Question 16. We are given the potential energy curve, that is, the potential energy with respect to position for an object of mass m. And for question 16, they ask, if the object is released at rest at position r naught, what is its speed at 2 r naught? There is no mention of a non-conservative force in this problem, therefore we can use conservation of mechanical energy. The total mechanical energy initial equals the total mechanical energy phi. Initially, the object is at rest, therefore we only have potential energy initial. Finally, we have potential energy final, and we know it's moving, therefore there is a kinetic energy phi. Substituting in our values from the graph, we get that the initial potential energy is 3 u naught, and the final potential energy is u naught, and substituting the equation for kinetic energy, 1 half mass times velocity final squared. Subtracting u naught from both sides, we get 2 u naught is equal to 1 half mass times velocity final squared. Solving for velocity final, we get that the velocity final is equal to the square root of 4 u naught over m. The correct answer is C.